welcome you to our foundation's sixth annual Golden Spur Gala. Once again this year, with your very generous assistance, we raise funds and awareness for issues faced by our nation's youth at risk. It's also important to recognize the corporate support that is given to the foundation. Walmart Canada Corporation, St. Joseph Communications, Motorola Canada Limited, WestJet, Huawei Technologies Canada, as well as many others. The support of Canada's youth at risk is the primary mission of the foundation. Since 1994, more than $3.5 million has been provided to over 650 community initiatives. There'll be no doubt um, everybody would share the view that it's the youth of today that will determine the success of this country tomorrow. On behalf of Motorola Canada, I'm proud to present the award to RCMP Commissioner William Elliott. On behalf of Prevent Alcohol and Risk-Related Trauma in Youth Party, we'd like to thank the RCMP Foundation for recognizing the valuable work of party program across the country. November 18th, 2005, I was pinned in between two vans, losing my left leg right on contact. Went to Sunnybrook Hospital. They saved my right leg, which I almost lost. And during my time at Sunnybrook, I got to meet the students. It really kind of opens their eyes more about just safety facts and driving and seat belts. This evening we will honor four RCMP members who have made a real difference. His goal was to improve rapport with the police services by providing the opportunity to experience police academy training during a mini boot camp. If it wasn't for the community groups, volunteers and funding from the Mount Police Foundation, these initiatives just wouldn't exist. She applies her broad experience and creative skills to organizing day camps, drug education workshops, prom nights, life jacket fashion shows, and library programs. Thank you and please enjoy the rest of your evening. As one of the kids said to me, it should be a rocking good time. His commitment has ensured a positive relationship between students, the community, and police. I would first like to thank the RCMP Foundation and the Selection Committee for this prestigious award. Her dedication and ability to address critical issues such as suicide, bullying, and drug abuse have earned her the respect of all members of the community. Thank you to the RCMP Foundation. Without you, so many of the projects would not have been possible. Please help me welcome to the stage Master Illusionist Brian Michaels. Thank you all for coming out. We'll see you all next year.